Hi guys, it's Emma again. So, on the 15th of June this year, a beautiful little five-year-old vanished into thin air, right under the nose of her mother. But how is that possible? And where is she? Many people have took to social media to speculate regarding the family, coming up with theories and ideas of what could have possibly happened that day in June. How can a small five-year-old living in a rural part of Tennessee, surrounded by a pack of dogs, three brothers, a mother and a grandmother, vanish right under their noses? First, we question the mother. Was she watching her? Did she leave her somewhere? Did she sell her? Was there an accident that day at the waterhole? With various ongoing Facebook posts from her father, some of which were quite angry and suggesting it was without a doubt an abduction, we then started to question the father. Who is he? What was his past like? Who are his family? And what convictions did he have? We even looked into the boy H that was with them that day at the waterhole. Did he have a motive? What was his relationship like with the mother? How did he get on with Summer? We even asked him what happened that day. But the one person who was apparently there with Summer for most of the day and we have not really touched on was Grandma. Grandma whose daughter is also missing. Summer's auntie, her mother's sister. And how many people do you know that have two family members missing without a trace within 10 years. So getting back to grandma. Grandma is apparently currently out of state with her sister, looking after her sister's husband, who has recently had a heart attack. Now I understand that she wants to be there for her sister in the time of need to support her and help her. You're there with your daughter who has a missing daughter, your grandchild. CPS is on the case. Detectives are swarming around. CPS are about to take all of your other children away. And Grandma leaves you on your own? Your mother leaves you alone? Would you not be there to support her? instead of leaving within days of her disappearance, taking your truck and disappearing out of state at a time when your daughter needs you the most? And when I'd hope detectives would want to question you further into the disappearance of your granddaughter after you'd been there with her all day, and maybe even check your truck sufficiently due to the fact that that was the vehicle that you were driving on the day of Summer's disappearance. Now I have various theories as to why the grandmother left the scene. The first being that Grandma has a... Grandma knew there was something going on at home that she didn't agree with and she took Summer out of the situation. Maybe the mum was involved and said to Grandma... Look, this is what's happening. I can't stand it anymore. He refuses to stop. Please take Summer away from this. And that's what they've done. Maybe they knew that if they come clean, then Summer would be brought back. He would go to prison. And if she loves him, she wouldn't want that. Despite the fact that she didn't like what was going on at home, she still doesn't want to lose him. He's providing keeping a roof over her head and he makes her happy in a lot of respects but in certain things I think maybe she wasn't happy and I think maybe there was something where they've organized something between themselves the mother and the grandmother Summer was taken out of the picture for her safety as we know according to the father's stepsister Things went on when they were younger and it started around the same age as Summer. So it is possible that certain things were going on in that house that the mother was not happy with. Maybe she was taken by Grandma out of state, away from it all. And you know what? If that was the case, I would be the first one to throw my arms in the air and wave, yes! 
but then there's other theories. Do you think Grandma is involved in her own daughter's disappearance, Rose? Do you think she's being unsympathetic towards Candace right now when she's just literally lost all of her children in a week and she's disappeared out of state? Or do you think something happened that day? An accident? Grandma did not want to be involved in it. She didn't agree with the end result and she disappeared. Or do you think that she's escaped the situation because she just didn't want to be involved, especially due to her daughter being missing? She didn't want the spotlight on her. Or do you think it was the grandma that did this? She's a common denominator. She lost her daughter without a trace. Then she lost her granddaughter without a trace. Who will it be next? I ask you guys, where's grandma and why did she leave? 